It's a common theory that roughly 65 million years ago, a fairly large rock came down from space and slammed right into the Yucatan Peninsula in Mexico, dramatically wiping out more than half of the Earth's species. Yes, we're mostly talking about the dinosaurs. But what that rock exactly was, was a point of contention with the science community, with some arguing the rock was a comet and others an asteroid. Now, some scientists say they've identified the catastrophic culprit as a comet. This comet conclusion was presented at the 44th Lunar and Planetary science conference. The research was based on evidence suggesting the object that left a large crater in Mexico was smaller than earlier thought. Until now, the widely held belief was that the end of the dinosaurs, commonly known as the KT event, started near the town of Chicxulub, Mexico. The impact resulted in a 110 mile wide crater and live science explains the force needed to make that kind of dent in the earth amounts to 100 trillion tons of TNT. To put it into historical comparison, that's more than one billion times the amount of explosives in the atom bombs that destroyed Hiroshima and Nagasaki. But the BBC reports other researchers still suspect an asteroid as the more likely candidate. They say a comet simply wouldn't have had the mass to cause such a large crater. For a smaller space rock to have produced such a wide crater, it would have had to be traveling fairly quickly, to say the least. And this theory is all under the assumption Chicxulú was ground zero. Scientists believe the impact site also could have been the Shiva crater in India. Other factors could have contributed to the dinosaurs in too, including dramatic climate change and volcanic eruptions. What we know for sure is that the dinosaurs died, and the only species said to have survived the alleged impact are birds. So what wiped them out initially, we may never know for sure. For Newsy, I'm Logan Tittle.